Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to my let's play of Europa Universal's free Divine Wind as Great Britain. Now, start of a new recording session, so there's a few little changes. For instance, oh, why am I trying to use WSD to move on the map? We've uh, changed Norway's flag uh, to represent more the current flag, not the coat of arms. And we've added our little Union flag in the corner as well. As well as... Oh, Woolwich has been fixed. Arcadia now actually has a new name like the rest of the uh, New Albion. It's Ross. Um, obviously, we had lots and lots of... Well, the English had lots and lots of explorers, Arctic and uh, Antarctic explorers who had the last name Ross. So I'm... It can be any of them. Well, any, any one of them you, you want it to be. I believe the rest of them down here was already named, so that's not changed. And I've made a start... At, yeah, please load them. At changing some of the names in India. Now, there was a lot more suggested uh, by British Dynamite, but I didn't want to change too many of them at once because, well, to give other people a chance to get them in, but the general idea was to use British, like, legends' names. Like, we have Nelson, Lennon, Churchill, Shakespeare, Newton, Wellington, and I've, I've changed the ones that I was more having trouble saying. Adadra is okay, Goa was okay, uh, Calcutt. I really want to put an A on the end of there, though. In fact, cow cut ah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, sorry, that's just made myself a little chuckle. But there's definitely some more that needs to change, like Pakamatamin. Any other ideas, suggestions? Uh, please put them forward. Uh, Zook Star Two Thousand suggested to change uh, one of the country's names uh, however uh, to New London, however we don't actually have it yet, so I haven't used New London, I'll keep it in mind for when we do get this territory but as for now, unfortunately we don't have it so I can't change its name and also Zoop Panic Car, uh, Fort Wolf unfortunately after I named Ross, Arcadia Ross I haven't got anywhere to put that one either so we do need some more land in Canada for your Fort Wolf. Now, let's see, I think that's basically everything I was going to be covering. Uh, Minor T General did suggest uh, to colonize more. I'm not sure if I have the economy for it, but I, I will actually try. Also, uh, to raise more troops, which he's made the suggestion, I think, uh, three videos ago, because there's one more, two more for me to upload. One of them will be today as I'm recording, the other one will be tomorrow. For me, so for you, that will be yesterday and the day before. <laughs> um, yeah, I probably should have got more troops. I, I commented saying, well, I don't think my economy could handle it, but now looking at the situation that we're in, because I, I didn't want to uh, let people know about this war. Oh, and I didn't start the timer. Oh, this is brilliant. Oh, also, I am using a new timer, which you might have heard it beep then. Oh, I'm going to have to pause because I just tried using my keyboard to work with the other computer. It works with a mouse, but obviously not with this. But either way, I'll be back shortly. There we go. All nicely started. Uh, no. It has a variety of noises, as you can tell, because the first one was... Oh, damn it. Uh, back again. Okay, this time I have got it and has a variety of noises. I'm gonna go through this recording session using different ones. The first one was that beep, I think you heard it. Uh, then there was the boo hiss, which I, to be honest, find quite funny just because, well, does anyone ever want the episodes to end? But you know, you'd, you'd rather maybe have the next one and carry on watching, but uh, we'll go through them all and you can leave a comment saying which one you preferred. But I'm definitely gonna persevere with this recording session, but. That little bit there with having to restart and restart and restart. No, that was not fun for me. Now we're going to leave, actually get started into the actual thing. Now, the timer's ticking away as it normally would, so the bit of me talking at the beginning is going to be extra. You're going to leave a one guy there to uh, keep the siege going. And then we're going to chase down the people sieging London. Now, this should keep them from refilling, so there's only going to be 700... Odd men instead of a thousand, which I guess should be a help. 
Oh no, we're going to lose you, aren't we? When do you get there? The 19th. Oh, we're likely going to lose you. Oh no, we're, we're chasing them. Wait, that was a battle where nobody died. So, what, what, they walked up to each other and went, Nah, I don't really want to do that, and they walked away again. Oh, for... Killy, killy! It's alright, they're both going to have some morale next turn, because of the turn of a month. Also, we have, <laughs> we have Portugal to fight. Now, that's actually rather interesting, because I wouldn't mind, for instance, taking the Algarve. Base tax 7... You know, it's a rich province, almost as rich as Lisbon. Base tax 6. Base tax 10. How rich was Portugal? But either way, I think that's to balance out for when they take all this crappy land. But why would they move? I mean, Pangeas is only a base tax 8. Actually, no, that's rich. How have they been improving their base tax? That can't be the standard ones. But either way, the Algarve does look nice on Tuarex. Our extended Gibraltar, so we'll we'll go for that. Although that's going to be a lot of infamy because we don't have any Casa Spelli. We've won the Battle of London. Uh, they're off to Wessex, so we'll chase them down. Uh, Battle of Procade has been won. And we finish them off. Yes! Oh, and the Battle of Wessex again, and we finish them off. This is not doing too badly. Yeah, and I lost a good chunk of my new navy, which is rather annoying. Oh, for crying out loud. The Portuguese have landed. Okay, you're going to go to Gawed. You're going to come out into the St. George's Channel. And we're going to use you to get across. Uh, Delaware has succeeded. We'll send another one. Revolt in Sidon. It's already been dealt with. The Battle of Andalusia was won. Good. Now you're going to... On the 22nd, on the 2nd of March. We'll go to the Algarve first. We'll have a go at sieging it. And it should stop that unit from spawning. I'm guessing they're actually getting more. But you want peace? You want white peace? I don't want white peace. That's the only thing I want from this war. So, no. It's probably a bad idea, but no. It's happened to us. So, oh, it stopped because it was being blockaded, didn't it? Like, no, you want to go over here. Into the boat. Ah, oh, the uh, Swiss, not the Swiss, the Swedish are fighting my naval pirates for me. Sorry, I was going to say naval rebels and then I said pirates and obviously naval pirates. Unless it's uh, pirates of a radio, which I don't think we have really yet to worry about. Then, you know, it is going to be naval pirates. You come down here. You're going to jump off into Linster. Battle of the Algarve. We have won. And we really do have too many cavalry there. So I'm going to split two off. Send them to Alentijo. Alentijo. Oh, you're offering peace. Oh, you're offering a white peace. Now, just before the episode started, while I was uh, yeah, changing the names, I was curious, and they wouldn't even accept if I forced, if I, I if I changed my religion. But now they want white peace. I don't know. I'm happy to let it run on. I want the Algarve. Oh, no, no, not both of you. You stay here. You CG, CG. It's fort level two already. That's going to be a pain. Uh, but yeah, we should have this sorted. And actually, when do you spawn out? Second. It's a month. I wouldn't get there in a month, would I? I would, the 14th. Then you get out on the 12th. If I went there, the 24th. So we'll stay here. We'll kill this one then. See if it's the 7th of August. We should more than easily be able to get up there to kill that one. Oh, I don't like they're going to get on here and maybe kill him. What are you guys? I forgot about you. You're going to come down here and help out him. You kill these Portuguese. The place which I said I can't pronounce has revolted. 
uh, Central Africa and in a King in a Congo. They're two huge wastelands, aren't they? Yes. But still, getting the wastelands is actually quite good because you can see where the provinces aren't. Where were we? Oh, there's a battle here. We're winning. Ooh. They actually moved on to me. Oh, no, that, that was a spawn. That was a spawn. That's fine. Uh, during the period March. April, May, June, July, August. So that's going to be a good while. You come down here, see if you can't deal with the guys in Cadiz. Battle of Munster has been won. Chase them down to Linster. Let's see. You are dealing with them rebels. We haven't landed any more guys here. We've got some more ships, which I want to try and group up. You really need to be docked up again so we can... Oh, they didn't land. They just dealt with my rebels and left. Revolt in Calais. Battle of Toulouse has been won. Pause, 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 pause. Battle of Toulouse has been won. Uh, uh, rather indecisively. They, they killed a lot more than what we did. Which isn't good. Uh, Battle of Linster has been won. And we've wiped them out. Lovely. Huge. Proctor. He's arrived. I don't really care about him. Spread of Discoveries. Zambia. Battle of Purgatory, we'll move you out of the way for now because I want to go back to you. Um, Battle of Cadiz, again, we're going to move you out of the way. Just... So where's Zambia? Zambia is... Uh... Oh! See, Zambia isn't that big in life now. <laughs> so I, I was thinking it was, I think, over here. But either way, let's go check on Purgatory. Oh, we automatically chased him down and we're already running for Calais, so that's fine there. Wait, 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 wait. Who funded you? Don't want the ships. The Holy Roman Empire is sending Catholic zealots into us. In the Battle of Cadiz, it's been won. We can't chase them down, though. You just sit in Lisbon, then, and we'll keep running you around if need be, but they'll get us some you know, line of sight on them. And hopefully just keep killing off one or two of them at a time. Oh, I had peace offers, didn't I? Oh, I, I, I missed the peace offers. That's fine. Battle of Lisbon has been won. 16%. It should be a good number for him. Battles only 17, actually. Of course, only 17, because we're only losing 1% from this CG here. Okay, well, you need to come back out of dock. You need to... Revolt in Alexandria. He should be okay over there. We've dealt with Park... I keep wanting to say Park Mandu, like Cat Mandu, but no, it's not that. You're going to come back over onto the British mainland. Battle of Calais has been won. Good. Um, their navy doesn't seem to be posing much of a threat, so... We'll actually go to the Straits of Dover. Delaware has failed. No, send another one. And I would be sending more, but every time I send one, I don't have any more left. Okay, that's fine. He's already there to be dealt with. Come on, we need to deliver free Kent. Actually, what's our current mission? Uh, discover so and so, which we believe is around here. Do we have any navies over here? We have one navy, which we can make a little smaller. Do we have any explorers? We do. I want to try and get that. I would, to be honest, when you're at war, I like getting the mission save so and so, save so and so, because you know, it's easy to do and you want to do it anyway. Whereas this, I'm not as fussed about doing. I'm not going to colonize it. I, I really don't like the missions where it says colonize this particular place and it picks somewhere usually completely awful. And we'll avoid them pirates because they're bigger than us, I believe. Oh no, wait, they're smaller. So we'll kill the pirates, go to Bermuda, heal up, and then we'll take the next step down again. But I better remember about it this time. Oh, 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 Portugal's invading. And Swiss. The Swiss. Oh. Well, they can't get a separate piece, at least. So, yeah, that's rather pointless. 
all these guys here now. I'm not going to just besiege it. Another battle of Cade. Good. I'll turn Hunt Rebels off temporarily. I think Berry has a... Yeah, 24. Come down to Berry, then I'll put you onto Hunt Rebels. Somebody's accepted peace with the Hordes. Doesn't really matter. Siege of Kent has fallen. A Gaza is in revolt. That's India and Lennon's India. Whoa! You came all this way to deal with my rebels. Oh no, wait, could you join in this fight? Yes. I think that might need to be a bit bigger. But either way, I'm happy with that. We can go kill the rebels in Lennon instead. Am I off to Nelson? Is that where you were hunting rebels from? Portugal. You're willing to offer white peace, but I think, I think, once we take the Algarve, we might even be able to get it from Sweden. Right, you come up there, then down here. He's not going to have time to get much morale under his belt before we actually do it. Battle of a West Bermudan Sea, hasn't taken too much damage. Uh, Battle of Barros. A revolt, sorry, in Barros. It's a battle one, that's the guy that I just sent up there. You should. Oh no, turn you on to Hunt Rebels and you'll go deal with him. Good, good, good. You can go back to... Actually, go to good word. Newy big ships. Newy big ships go to Calais. So we can actually get a more modern navy. I think is why we suffered so much with the, um, basically last time. Go to Derby. Yeah, m oh no, wait, not capable of holding you. Supply limit 15. Oh wait, you're 14, yeah, more than capable. As for you, you can go to London. Well, this timer is definitely clearer showing me how long we have left, but I'm not too sure on it. I don't like Navarra being there. We have a colonist, but I think, I think Delaware should be, it's only halfway through. I, I want to keep one so I can always keep one being sent. If I have an extra one, then that's fine. Or if I think I'm going to suddenly you know, inherit five from a mission. That's it. How bad are you, actually? Are you healed up yet? You are? Good. And that rather disgruntled, disgruntled crowd has shown us that... It is the end of this episode. Um, as always, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank you for watching and say goodbye. Goodbye.